The trees first encountered on this trail are sable palms. They have large fan-shaped fronds that provide shade and a pleasant rustling sound when stirred by the wind. The sable palm, also known as the cabbage palm, is the Florida state tree. Sable or cabbage palms were important to early settlers for a variety of reasons. Their straight, limbless trunks were ideal for the construction of cabins, and resistance to rot made them suitable for building docks. The heart of the palm is edible and could be cooked or used for making salads. Other considerations were that the tree was common and it was easy to cut down. The berries of the palm are an attractive food source for raccoons and birds. There are eight species of palms native to Florida. By far, the sable palm and the saw palmetto are the most common of these. Another tree that has an interesting relationship to the sable palm is the strangler fig. Occasionally, a fig begins growing in the trunk or in the crown of the sable palm. The fig sends its roots down along the trunk and surrounds the palm with its root system. The small fruits produced by the strangler fig are eaten by many different species of birds. These birds pass the seeds along to the fig's next victim. The boat-tailed grackle can be heard year-round in Florida. It is primarily a coastal species, but can be found throughout most of the state. They have a wide range of diet that includes the fruits of cabbage palm and strangler fig, small fish, spiders, insects, small reptiles, and seeds. These birds often form small flocks and go through the area seizing any food source available. There are several very different vocalizations made by these species. Here is a sample of what they may sound like. 